lobster with an opera duo. He's sure not to attack while we're both on stage. Meanwhile, the old cut the lines to the chandelier and drop it on his head. I'll swipe the switch and we'll both find Burry. By then, the black water is sure to be running clear and he'll be free to come with us. God, I hope this works, because I am not... Hey, me going back out is sly. The fuck? Must have been a glitch. Hmm. So much for being in Venice. so cool how it jumped! Guess that's where I gotta go. Cool. Dude, under the umbrellas they look like pizza. This is it! Octavio is due to arrive for the opera recital in just a few minutes. We did a good job taking out the advertising. No one's shown up to listen. No audience means no demolition demonstration. True, but to finish the job, we'll need to take out the main tar vacuum. Use your disguise to gain entry to the opera house. Then head down to the pump room and let me in through the side door. No problem, signore. Are you fucking serious? If I can handle a gun, then... Sorry. But how will I get in? I don't know. I've gotta stop playing those video games. Hey, you! What's the carnival at password? Transmitting password. Ah. Tenor bass, tenor, tenor. Okay, but don't be long inside. The boss's opera recital is about to start. Oh, God. I'm gonna die. Dude, I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Stay in disguise here or the operation's a bust. Halt! Watch the midnight the password. Got it. Here it is. Alto base, alto, alto. Yep. This recital is gonna be a drag. Between you and me, I hate opera. Okay. You there. What's Octavio's house password? Transmitting password. House password? Tenor soprano, tenor soprano. Okay. The boss has been practicing for months for this day. He sings a great. Soprano password. Uploading you the password. Tenor base, tenor, tenor. Okay. Pass a word to the rest of the guys that under no circumstances am I to be disturbed during my big comeback recital. Yes, sir. I'm certainly looking forward to the performance. But once I'm done in the pump room, I'll be headed out to the stage. Um, if it isn't too much trouble, would you help me with this double button security door? But of course, for a fellow musical lover, it would be a pleasure. Oh my god! On the three. One, two, three! Be quick in there, you won't want to miss out. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, is there guards in there? Slide! Slide! Over here! Nice to see you, pal. <sighs> who knew? For Bentley who broke his legs, okay, though. We need to act quickly while the recital is getting underway. 
You ready with the bombs? Once I've destroyed all six tar pipes, the vacuum should start to lose suction. Look, if those bombs attract any guards, let me do the fighting. You just focus on taking out the tar pipes. We need to stay on schedule. <laughs> Fuck, dude. It looks tough. Might take some more bombs. How is this possible? Okay, I'm going in as Bentley, but if any guards come in. I just knew something was up. How is it not working? Dude, setting off those bombs isn't gonna be easy. We've got company. Just stay on those tar pipes. This could get hairy. And... Okay, okay. There's two more. Just one pipe left. Nice work, partner. Is there still time to catch Octavio's recital? We're right on schedule. If my calculations are correct, he should be about to perform an aria originally written as a duet. That's when we strike. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I know, but this is bad enough. Playing like games. Think he'll really let you on stage with him? Of course, he's a musician. He'll be overjoyed to have a lyrical counterpoint. Just be ready to drop the chandelier when I've lured him underneath. <sighs> so much is for Italy. He'll know something's up. This is gonna hurt. Ba ba 
Bitch, she infiltrated it. They still got the demolition switch. You never ever freeze. I'll drive. You shoot. Screw you, Carmelita. I'm not ever going to jail. I need immediate pickup. Criminals are headed east. All units converge. Roger. Sorry, Cooper. This time I've got you surrounded. Oh shit. No, we're dead. <sighs> Can you go any faster? This is it. Shoot out his engine and we'll have it. The canal is full of dust. We're in big trouble here. I think I lost the cops. I can't believe she fucked up the plan. Why did she do that? Get the cops out of the way. Shut up, Carmelita, you suck. these things don't go as fast as they can. That's not gonna be tough enough. Switch and we'll all try to ditch these cops. You chase me for this? Fine, big shot. Took me six months to prepare this deal. But what the hey? I got more where these came from. You guys see that boat go out of control and jump and smash into that thing? Destruction! So cool! You think that was a cool punk? <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> He's destroying half of Venice! <sighs> you monster! Stop it! Stop it! Murray, I need your help. I've never seen someone move that fast. Octavio's old, but he's still got it. Let's take him together. But! But! I vowed to my guru that I'd renounce all violence! And the water is still black! It'll be clear any minute. Trust me. Now, let's take him. You are right to be scared, people. Your wheelchair friend should have been so smart. Murray! Help! Bentley! That does it! I don't floss my teeth with your smart! <laughs> the Murray returns! The team reunion. Guess it's me oh, it's versus. Run into the tarpaulin. That should slow him down. <sighs> I got hit into the tarpaulin, so I, I mean I'm trying to, but. Maybe we got him on our team. Wait a minute, isn't Sly supposed to help us?
Try not to get knocked down. The valve's empty. I'll crack another. The valve got empty. Tar's ready to flow. I mean, I haven't gotten hit yet. Take this. Hurry, these pumps are out of tar. I saw some more valves over by the top station. Follow me to a fresh supply. <laughs> Without the tar, I'll crush you boys and make a bomb. So I'm not to think Murray's come back to his senses. You saw? Don't get hit by that. God, if Nightfall was here with me, this would have been easy. Thanks, Sly. That's one good. This tar valve's dry. I'll open another. Hang tight. God, this guy does not give up. Ready with the tar. He's still got a little bit of health left. Look. It's dry. I'll warm up the next one. Never mind. Well, that's it. The old guard's out. And a new generation steps in. That's right. Step in. Big time. Come on, Murray. I got the demolition switch. Let's get Bentley and run for it. We got cops closing in. Oh shit. <laughs> I fucking hate the cops. No, in the game they try to get you, but at least we kind of crushed him. And the team's all back together. Nah. With the fight over, we went back and scraped Bentley off the pavement. It was touch and go for a while there, but we managed to sneak out right under Carmelita's nose. Octavio wasn't so lucky. The guy got 30 years behind bars for what he did to Venice. I guess Italians don't like it when you sink their landmarks. Ironically, he found success as a singer while in jail. After all, most of his old fan base was already in the family. But the big score here was bringing our old pal back into the game. Once he put on those gloves and that mask, he was clear to everyone, most of all him, that the Murray had returned. Yay! Well, oh, so much is going to put the team. seemed just like old times. The gang was back in action. But little by little, we learned that Murray's heart just wasn't in it. Without the guru's permission to give up on his dream time training, he'd never really feel comfortable returning to the gang. 
he knew we needed to help him out. <laughs> so we packed up our things, whipped up some quick disguises, and headed for the Australian Outback. Along the way, Murray told us story after story about his teacher's amazing abilities. Apparently, this guru of his was capable of fantastic feats. He used the dream time to blend perfectly into his surroundings and even gain mental control over the weak-minded. If even half the stories were true, then this was a guy I just had to meet. Hmm. Our gang needed to grow its ranks for a chance to get inside the Cooper vault. And this guru, this outback mystic, was looking like the best recruit we could have ever asked for. However, when we finally arrived in the outback, it was a shock to find that things had changed. <sighs> and the guru was nowhere to be seen. Rumble down under that this is gonna get a little bit into Shakesville. And a twinge hurt bruise. 8.41 p.m. believe they did that. The miners have really tore this place up looking for opals. Watch your step, they're sure to get rough defending their clay. One wrong move and I'm dead. My master spends most of his time up there in that cave, overlooking the valley and contemplating the depths of deepness. I really appreciate you breaking the news to him that I want to break off my training. No problem, pal. I'm looking forward to meeting you. Anybody you call master must be a heck of a guy. Oh, he's off! He'll get inside your head, bring you out to six ways from Sunday. Uh, awesome. Cute. That is so fucking cute, but you know. Ideas where he might be. Well, that's his hut, but he doesn't really hang out there on account of the smell. The smell? It's a long story. I had to apologize up and down for like a month before he'd speak to me again. What did you do? The unspeakable slide. The unspeakable. Mm, thanks for speaking of it. I'm headed for the hut. <laughs> How am I gonna get past those guards? I told you to bug off, bitch! That's a swamp. Sorry, Marie. Nobody's 
home. By the looks of it, I'd say the girl was finding someone or something off here. I'm starting to think the miners might have got to him. You might be right. They come in and be all angry and yelling and he'd be all peaceful and they just get ticked. Then he'd try to find a middle way and they just go crazy and smash everything up and then haul them off. Where do you think they might have taken him? They got him! My master's a goner! Maybe we should get Bentley on the line. It's tough to say, but given the layout of the miners' camp, I'd venture a guess that they use that area with a high fence as a makeshift stockade. Hmm. Looks like there might be a way up using that cliff below. Shouldn't be a problem. Just keep an eye out for that gyrocopter. I'm positive it's what gave away the guru's position. Good tip. Thanks, pal. friend of Murray's. He's come asking to be released from his training. Sure, I'll just bust you out of here and we'll go talk to him. Hi, You seriously won't leave without your gear? Yeah, I can see that the miners have really done a number on your land here. As for your walking staff and moonstone, me and my gang have a real talent for stealing back things that were wrongfully taken. <laughs> the guru won't leave the stockade until he has his walking staff and his moonstone. He also insists that we purify Air Rock of all miners. Only then will the green time spirits be appeased and the guru will be free to use his power. Sly must have impressed him in their conversation because now he is requesting that Murray and I meet with him individually. Something about judging our spiritual centers. I've discovered a passage for one of the miners' caves that should make getting up to the guru less difficult. He also mentioned that the miners had foolishly unearthed the mask of dark earth. I guess it was his job to guard the thing, and now that it's out, bad things are sure to follow. Sounds like mumbo jumbo to me, but we've encountered some unexplainable phenomena over the years, so I'm not going to rule it out as a threat to our operation. around here. It's a secure location with plenty of guys on duty to provide protection. I agree. The most likely candidate is this by staff. 
It appears to have the highest number of workers coming in and out. Good place to start. I'm on. Hmm. He must have saw me. Those caves are gonna be dark. Your optimizer goggles will make navigation easier. If they're here, the guru's items will be stashed at the far end of this cave. Far end. It's obvious. Okay, so I'm using the D button. Alright, so I got the Moonstone. Time to take you back to your rightful owner. These miners are smarter than they look. They booby trap the Moonstone. It looks like a light sensitive detonator. If I can get it outside and into the sunlight, it should power down. <sighs> is a race against time. These things can jump too, huh?
watch your step. These bike pits are deep. What happened? What's so special about this stand? Another booby trap for a stick? These guys are paranoid. And from the sound of it, they've called in reinforcements. Nothing like a horde of angry gamers to make things a bit more interesting. <laughs> Holy crap, dude! Fuck, fuck, fuck. This isn't good. I guess sliding on metal kind of makes it easier. How the fuck am I gonna get out? Okay, we're good. I don't know, I'll probably call Nightfall between tomorrow, Thursday, or Friday. It's like the same stuff over and over again. Sorry guys, my sister TV. Uh, 
According to the mine's hydraulic flow chart, the door ahead appears to be sealed shut. Then I'll just bash it in! What's the good of having fists if you can't smack steel doors with them? It's too thick, even for you. No, to get through, we'll have to overload the pressure in this piston. You want me to punch it? I can do that! Use your aboriginal ball form to bounce on top of the piston and smash it down. Build up enough hydraulic pressure and the door is sure to open. Piston beware! You're about to be bounced! likely Yeah, that's a lot to deal with. 
but we'll help you, I promise. Oh, da, da. Thanks, Guru. I'm happy to see you, too. I'm guessing they've made their amends. I guess Sly's here to join us.